some of the uh, some of the beautiful features that I absolutely wanted to show before we go, um, just so that I can briefly get through what we're doing here, and you can see some of the power inside Resolve. Um, these are identified, right? So you can see this is a magic mask that I've done, and you can see where the mask is on and where the mask is off because I haven't tracked the rest of the mask. But basically, I tracked the green and said yes, make all of that green, and you can see that it's able to find the green area and then track all of that. Um, I would have to track it forward. So let's move to the color page to see where I'm actually doing that work. There's my mask. Okay, so this clip selected. Let me go now to the magic mask tools, right? As I hover over this tool area, it shows you what's active. So I go to magic mask and you can see I've got this one object tracked, this one selection. Here, please do this part, right? And if I were to choose tracking it forward, well, the magic mask is going to start chunking along and figuring out where that matches. And of course, where it matches, you can see that it's actively applying that new color grade to where it matches. I'm just going to stop now because we have enough to see that that's working, right? You can see it go away. Okay. So now um, that's one method of magic mask. That's magic mask object where I've just drawn a selection around it. Well, this is another object of magic mask. I've drawn a selection of, around the car. And um, what's important to notice about the way that magic mask works in this case around the car is that, um, as you'll probably see as this truck starts to obscure it, the track itself doesn't lose that it was tracking the car. Here we've decided that this, uh, this blonde woman has strawberry blonde hair, so we've made the stroke visible. In fact, you can kind of see, you know, when I hover over, um, you can see when I turn this little preview on and off for the mask opacity, that this is the effect of the change and the mask was, was being shown, right? And so as, as she moves across, you can see that the track itself has found what is her hair, but is not her head, okay? And that's because we chose, um, you know, hair as the person's feature to show here. Uh, we showed this probably um, the most, I think, when we debuted this feature. But um, what's important to see here is that while uh, I guess I didn't have the thing enabled so you can see it, so let me just stop. Let's turn that on. You can see the selection that was created and how it's tracked this horse. And let's go ahead and, uh, and track him again. So you can see this actually functioning. Um, he's obscured, right? The person on horseback is obscured by the rhino. And Magic